Hello students, myself Sagar Choksi from LJ Institutes of Engineering and Technology. So in last session, we have started a new chapter that is Chases Frame. And we have already completed three basic topics. First topic that related to definition on Chases. Second topic that is definition or functions of Chases. Third one that is component of Chases Frame. Right. So in this particular lecture, we will discuss about types of chases. Basically, there are four different types of chases. First one that is ladder chases. Second one that is monocoque chases. Third one that is backbone chases. And fourth one that is space frame chases. Right. So in this particular chapter, we will discuss these four types of chases. And also we will discuss about difference between ladder chases and monocoque chases. It is very important difference, right? So let, let's start lecture number three that related to types of chases. So the first and important one that is types of chases. Okay, there are mainly four different types of chases. First of all, why we classify? Why we classify different types of chases? Because ultimately it depend on size and design. It ultimately depend on uh, passenger capacity. It ultimately depend on passenger load. Okay, so there are four different types of chases. Why we classify different types of chases? Because ultimately there are different applications. If you can take a bus, if you can take auto rickshaw, there are different. There are difference. Okay, difference in structure. There are difference in material. Okay, so basically according to application, according to passenger capacity, right? There are four different types of chases here. First one that is ladder frame, second one that is monocoque frame, third one that is backbone frame, it is very important backbone frame and fourth one that is space frame. According to different application, according to uh, passenger capacity, according to different material, size, design, we will classify this type of chases. Okay, so move forward to next slide. Next one and important one that is ladder frame. Okay. So, first of all, we will discuss about example, application. So, it is useful in bus or truck. Okay, it is useful in bus or truck. You can see in image, there are shaft, there is one frame in which engine and different kind of uh, mechanical component are connected and also tire are connected. Okay, so this is what ladder frame it is made from round or rectangular, sorry, rectangular channel through straight or curved member, right? Second one that is, it provides sufficient strength because ultimately in bus and truck, okay, there are uh, heavy duty, it is like a heavy duty, okay, passenger capacity are high, okay, so it provides sufficient strength for holding the weight of the component, okay, so this is what ladder frame, third one that is, ladder frame is placed something in the rare and supported in suspension point. It is very important. Fourth one that is example application. So in bus and truck chases, this type of ladder frame are used because ultimately it is made from round or you can take a rectangular channel. Okay. And it is very heavy duty. Okay. Heavy duty channel. Okay. And it is very useful in bus and truck. Okay. Right. So it provides sufficient strength for holding the weight of the component. So this is what ladder frame. So move forward to next slide. Monocoque chases. So it is just like it is just like one piece structure. Okay. As you can see in image, it is just like one piece structure which define the shape of your car. Okay. Which define the shape of your car. Okay. Right. So in this particular image, you can see it is kind of one, uh, one, one piece structure which define the overall shape of the car. Right. Second one that is ladder chases only provide a stress member and need to build a body around it. It is not like a frame. It is not like a frame and over there we, we will put a body. It is not kind of structure. Okay. In this particular monocoque chases, it is just like one piece structure which define the overall shape, shape of your car. Okay. Second one that is ladder chases only provide stress member and need a build a body around it. 
one that is in monocoque chassis door bonnets panels and roof are added okay so basic difference between ladder ladder chassis and monocoque chassis is very important right fourth one that is light in weight comparatively you can uh, compare with ladder arm okay ladder chassis so light in weight compared to ladder chassis so this is what monocoque chassis basically it is just like a one piece structure which define the overall shape in uh, for example we will take one application normally each and every car okay uh, which is having monocoque chassis okay in bus in truck there is ladder chassis right so this is what the difference between ladder chassis and monocoque chassis so move forward to next slide next one that is backbone chassis third and important one that is backbone chassis so as you can see in image it is just like a small sports car right this chassis is full enclosed to be right structure and cover or handle all the load right third one that is it has compact shape as it is having triangular cross section you can as you can see in image there is one tri triangular cross section and cover less space compared to monocoque chassis and uh, ladder chassis fourth one that is less protection against side wall as you can see in image there is less protection against side wall and last one that is cost ineffective for mass production okay it is useful in small sports car so this is what backbone chassis it is different from ladder chassis and monocoque chassis okay it is just like a small sports car right so move forward to fourth one fourth one that is space frame so here i have attached two image so that you can directly understand space frame so the first and important one that is used okay in racing car this type of space frame are used okay so it uses a series of small diameter as you can see in image it uses a series of small diameter tube to achieve strength and rigidity with low weight okay second one that is there are two main changes in racing car first one that is space frame and number two that is monocoque tube changes right third one that is it consists of metal element such as a steel or aluminum tubing pipe are placed as you can see in image there are two types of material here we can use there are two types of material steel or aluminum for tubing pipes right fourth one that is space frame have been used in the construction of racing car so space frame is useful in racing car it is the combination of two types of chassis first one that is space frame number two that is monocoque chassis in this particular chassis we can use two different kind of material steel and aluminum next and important question that is ladder chassis versus monocoque chassis right so here i have attached one table so that you can directly understand the difference between ladder chassis and monocoque chassis right so we have already completed explanation what about ladder chassis and what about monocoque chassis so the first and important one that is it can use straight or cow member connected by two or more than two cross members in particular ladder chassis whereas in monocoque chassis it is like a one piece structure which define the overall shape of your car second one that is weight so in ladder chassis compared to monocoque chassis it is having it is having more weight or you can take it has more weight compared to monocoque chassis right whereas in monocoque chassis it is having less weight compared to ladder chassis right third and important one that is application where ladder chassis are used so bus in bus and truck ladder chassis are used whereas in monocoque chassis whereas in monocoque chassis a normal car structure are developed by this particular chassis okay so this is what the difference between ladder chassis and monocoque chassis so thank you thank you so much in this particular session we have completed types of chassis and difference between monocoque chassis and ladder chassis so in next session we will discuss about car body different types of car body okay so thank you thank you so much Thank <music> you.